On further inspection, there's also there's also this thing here, which moves this. You see that? See how it moves it out? It brings it back. Then there's this, moves it up and down, and this moves it left and right. So we got left and right, up and down, and extension here, extension here. You see that? So that's what moves this, you see? And then this, you can tighten it down here to make it tighter or less tight. And that goes around the eyepiece. But these, you can put around this, like this. See how this pops open? And you get it around there, and then this will make a tighter grip, I think. Let's see. Let me set this right here for now. And then if I pull this off, and I slip this down over it, like that, you follow me? Then, oh, oh, oh. then I can get this. I got to open it up. I can get this over this, like that, and then tighten it down. Just like that. You follow? Now this is on there good. And then I can make my adjustments with my, you know, where I'm going to put the phone. So I got to slide the phone in. So I pull it over like that, get the phone in. Then I've got to get my, my focal point in there. And I can do that by changing all of this and moving it. Like this will make this come up and go down, right? And this, if I turn it, this makes it go up and down. So you can get this positioned right. I'm going to put this back on there for right now. And then the other one makes it go to the left and the right. So, you know, on the iPhone, the eyepiece is right here. So once you get the iPhone in here, you've got to get this, you know, so it's even with that. And then it focuses right over it. And so we're going to work on that tonight. Yeah. <laughs> and then we'll see if we can get some video of the stars. Let's go ahead and take off our lens cap. Huh? And now, we got to put our phone in here. So what they do is they give you this polar. So what you can do is set your, set your phone in like this, and then slide it over until it pops in. Now, if I move this way, you can look and see exactly where your lenses are. And, and I really need to kind of move out a little bit, about like that. And then maybe I can turn it a little bit up because I want to try to get that one lens centered and then I'm going to move it over and then I'm going to slide it over a little bit and I'm going to work it till I get it kind of centered and I think I'm pretty center right there let me let me see yeah so you can work these both at the same time and um, then once you've got that, I'm going to bring it up a little bit and then bring it over. I think I got to go down. Yeah. See, because I'm looking in the, I'm looking at the phone to make sure that I've got it right. That should be it. Now I can go closer like that, or I can go farther away until I get my image in focus. And then once I'm there, bam, Bob's your uncle, I just slide over here, and that's basically how it works. And here's the lens thing. And you're gonna have to play with it to really get to get your phone on there right. But that's kind of how you do it. All right, so we're gonna put this on. I'm gonna take this cap off right now. And you'll notice that this is like spinning. I'm gonna get it on there straight. So it doesn't doesn't spin out. There we go. You gotta tighten this. So I have this on here. And you need this because you need this to be able to grab a hold of it. Alright, so make sure you got everything tight, right? Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna open this and you're gonna put it down on it. You may have to open it wider by twisting this. And then I'm going to put it right on there like that. 
And once it's on there, I'm gonna twist this in tight and lock it on. So now we're locked on, okay? So that's it, that's how we do it, right like that. So I wanna get a picture of the moon, right there. This is just using the, uh, that's using my iPhone. And now we've got to just put our iPhone in there and we're going to, and we're going to try to do some video of that moon. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to put our iPhone in the carriage, right? Here's the carriage. So what I usually do is slide it in like that and then I'm going to pull the other side open. So there we go. Now we've got to get our position right above. Uh, we got to get our, our iPhone thing right above that. So that's going to take a little, a little bit of work. But first of all, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna spot it onto the moon. Let me back up a little bit so you can see. I'm gonna use this, I gotta turn this, right? I'm gonna do it bright so I can see. And then what we gotta do is come over here. All right, so we gotta turn it on. And you'll notice when I do that, here, we're good, right? So first of all, I'm just gonna to try to move it a little bit right now like this. Now I can kind of position this a little bit better and there's a bunch of tools to do it. It's gonna take a little bit of work. But first I'm gonna get it on the moon. I gotta position it on the moon. So I'm gonna look through here, and I've got a long ways to travel, so here we go. Let me go down. Oh, I'm almost right there. Okay, I think I'm right on the moon. Let me see if I can show you. So if you look through here, you should see a red dot, and it should be right on the moon. Might not be able to see it. Yeah, there we are. Oh, so hard to get. Anyway, well, anyway, I do have it on there. All right, so now I've got to try to adjust this. So I've got to move it this way. So I'm going to turn it. Oh, that's down. That's this way. Okay, this way. All right, now I think I'm getting there. Yes, see that? See the moon there? There it is. Okay, we're on it. Now we just gotta focus it. I mean, that's right dead center, right? All right, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna loosen this. All right, so I kinda got an idea of where it's at, but I wanna see if I can focus it before. So let's go ahead and pop this off for a second. And then I gotta look in there and see if I can focus it. Huh. I can see where we're at because I think it moved. Yeah, we moved it. Got to get back on it. Yeah, now I'm on it. Really got to twist this. And we got to go the other way. There we go. Almost there. So close. All right, I'm good. Now we got to just move it back into position. But now let's put our, our thingamabob back on. Hopefully be able to see it. Where's my control to move it forward? Okay, okay so that, that should be close there. Right there, now I just gotta get the moon back in focus. And all we see now is, now we should be right on it. And I think you can almost see it. There it is, the moon. <laughs> you guys see? There it is. So now if I want, I can do a video of it. And then it's kind of moving on us. There it is. All right, so not bad, huh? The problem is, is that this, you see how it's making that? I have to tilt it up a little bit. 
And when I do that, it shakes. So I've got to figure out what I've got to do to do, make that work a little bit better so that it's not shaking. All right, so here it is. We've got it in the center. And um, so let's bring it over a little bit. That doesn't look too bad. Let's go video. There it is. The video is bigger, right? For some reason, I need to, I've got to focus it better. There we go. That's the moon, ladies and gentlemen. That's the moon right there. All right, so it kind of works. I don't, you know, I would say it's not the best, but it's better than a poke in the eye with a sharp stick. And you can go like this. Unless I tilt this up. There we go. Let's see if we can get a better focus on it. Yeah, it doesn't, it's not letting me focus it good. But I mean, that's better than, it's not too bad. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel and check out my other awesome videos. Peace out.